I'm Louise King with the Tropical Fruit Growers of South Florida, and today we're going to make dragon fruit sorbet. For this recipe, you'll need the pulp from about four to five dragon fruits, which is about four and a half cups of fruit. You also need one cup of water, two tablespoons of lime juice, and two tablespoons of sugar. To prepare the sorbet, scoop out the pulp from the dragon fruit and put it into a blender. And it comes out real easy. You go right up to the edge of the rind. Oops. Yeah, don't worry about the seeds, they're edible and you hardly feel them at all. And now we'll add the water and the lime juice. the lid on. Don't forget that. And you don't need to do much, just a little bit. But once your mixture is all blended, pour it into the ice cream maker can. And follow directions on the ice cream maker that you have. If you don't have an ice cream maker, don't worry about it. You can pour this mixture into a glass bowl or metal bowl, put it in the freezer, and then after about half an hour or so, take it out, use a whisk to stir it up, put it back in for another half hour, and take it out, stir it back up again until it gets to the proper consistency. Okay, we're done. Isn't that beautiful? It's a dragon fruit sorbet. When I was scooping the pulp out of the dragon fruits, I saved the rinds and I froze them, and they're going to be used as my serving dish. So I'm scooping the ice cream out of here. Put it in here. And I can also use the white as well. For this recipe, and also to order some fresh Florida dragon fruit, Please visit our website at tropicalfruitgrowers.com.